are right outside of Massage Envy and we're gonna go in and get a massage. It's been a long time, so I'm super excited. We're doing a couple's sports massage. There we go, we're doing a couple's sports massage, so let's go. We just got done with our massages and it was so relaxing. I had done legs a couple days ago, so my quads were so sore. He was like pushing on my quads and I was like, oh, breathe through it, breathe through it. This is good for your muscles. But it felt so good afterwards. Actually, when he was done, I was like, wow, like my legs don't feel as sore. It just, it's amazing, so. I'm heading to the salon right now. I'm gonna go get my hair done. But today, I really wanna talk to you guys about how to build muscle. You guys saw that I went to go get a massage. I just got a spray tan that doesn't really help with muscle other than making it pop a little bit <laughs> visually, but we are going to go over how to build muscle, which is probably why you clicked on this video. And uh, yeah, so hang tight. I will see you in the salon. All right guys, we are here. We're at the salon. This is Bella Viva in Cunha. I'll leave all the descriptions below. We're about ready to get this blonde again. Uh, Chrissy is in the back mixing up the color. So excited. La, 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 la. with my cotton candy hair today, but I love this so much. So Chrissy said, hey, you wanna be pink today? And I'm like, uh, yes, I definitely wanna be pink. Details will be in the description box below for Chrissy Cam, she's amazing. Thanks, Chrissy, this is amazing, I love it. <laughs> We're resetting, this is take two of a vlog. It's not supposed to be this serious. Okay. Go again. All right. <laughs> I can't. Okay, so we're out at Colina and um, we are just left the salon and I really wanna to talk to you about the title of this video, which is how to gain muscle. So let's go sit down and we'll talk about the first tip. All right, so we are out at Colina. That is so amazing out here. Uh, a lot of people come out here on vacation. There's a ton of resorts out behind us, um, but the first thing I want to talk about is consistency. Um, when you're trying to grow your muscles, you have to be consistent. Just like anything else with fitness and in life, if you want to be successful at it, you have to be consistent. So making sure you get to the gym, weight training is very important. It doesn't have to be every day, of course. You definitely need some rest days in there, but you should make sure you are getting to the gym regularly throughout the week. Um, and even if you start out with a couple days here or there, Make sure it's two days, three days every single week, and then add a day in. But make sure you're getting your rest days, and remember, consistency is super key in anything you do with fitness. All right, we're back home, and I wanna tell you guys my tip number two. This one is pretty darn important, and this one's everyone's least favorite, whether it's losing weight or putting on muscle. Nutrition, nutrition plays a very important role in gaining muscle. So first tip, under nutrition, Point A, have a diet high in protein. It's 
pretty obvious, right? So you guys can get it in your food, like natural food sources, or you can use a supplement like a protein shake, super easy. There's tons of things out there, but have a diet high in protein. Wanna, wanna come feel that, Steve? Uh -huh, no? <laughs> Later, brain check. Nutrition, point B. You need to have a calorie surplus, a slight calorie surplus, which is everyone's like second least favorite thing is we're all scared of adding a little bit too much food. Now don't go crazy, don't go out and eat everything and hashtag for the gains because then you're gonna pack on a lot of pounds with that uh, of fat and you're not gonna want that. So we're trying to get nice lean muscle. So you wanna have a slight surplus in calories. Now everybody's slightly different, there's tons of different factors, but you can go on and Google a macro calculator and use anyone, you can type in your personal information and it can give you a close range of what your caloric need is. Hey guys, good morning. Today we're headed out to Kailua Beach and we are gonna go kayaking out to the Mokes, which are a couple islands right off the windward side of Oahu. Oh my gosh, I've wanted to do this forever. I'm so excited. I'm sorry if I'm yelling. I can't control myself. <laughs> So excited. <laughs> We're meeting up with some of our friends. Uh, it's Aloha Friday, so it's a beautiful day. I wanna give you guys tip number three on building muscle. So another tip for building muscle is recovery. And that may sound really obvious, but it is really important to be getting good sleep and allowing your body to actually heal itself after you've broken down the muscles. A rule that I kind of live by when I lift is to separate when I work out a muscle group with two days of rest. So for example, if I lifted legs on Monday, I don't wanna lift those legs again until Thursday. So I try to kind of space out my workouts that way. Sometimes it doesn't work the greatest, sometimes maybe there's a day, but I just try, if I'm gonna do legs again before that, it'll be one day will be quads and the next day could be glutes and hamstrings or something along that variation. The only muscle group that I have an exception with this on and you know it's kind of like a common thing for people is uh, working abs and working calves those you use a lot more frequently so you can work those a little bit more frequently and um, I've never had issues with that uh, but yeah this allows your body to actually recover and rebuild that muscle because it's tearing the muscle and then rebuilding it so you're gaining that lean muscle before you break it down again. Otherwise, you'll just continue to break it down and your body will never fully recover and uh, not a good thing and not what we want. So that's tip number three. I will see you guys out of the kayaks and stay tuned for your last tip on how to build muscle. All the limits with you right now So what you feeling to sit and scream And we're not coming home tonight We're living quick in the world Gotta hit right now People talk and tell what you wanna hear now But they all disappear They will let you down So we better stick together Let's come whatever We're not coming home tonight We're living quick in the world Gotta get it right now
All right, so we just got back from kayaking. It was so awesome. We got super burnt. It was an amazing workout. It was actually a lot harder than I had expected. All right, I wanna share with you guys my last tip for muscle growth, which is variation. Now, it's really important to switch up your workouts. So for me, I do the same workout-ish for about a month, and then I really wanna switch it up. So ways you can switch it up are not necessarily doing entirely new movements all the time, which I like to do. I kind of get bored with doing the same thing. But if you're just starting out and you have a workout plan, that's great. Follow that and you can do that for about a month. But a way you can add in variation is changing the reps, changing the weight that you're lifting, or changing up the workout movement. So there's so many ways that you can actually make variation within your workouts. Um, it doesn't have to be just changing the movement. It can be changing that weight, like I said, and it can be uh, changing the rep range. Uh, so just switch it up, keep your body guessing. It's gonna be the best way to help you actually gain some muscle is by keeping those muscles guessing because our bodies are really good at being smart and figuring out and getting smart to what we're doing. Um, so variation is that last key for you guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed all of my tips in this vlog. Um, there's one more thing that I wanna show you guys. Uh, I wanna do a little shout out here. I have one of my competitor friends from Omaha uh, actually sent me something, and this was earlier, and little side note, I we kinda were doing some renovations and this got shuffled away with it, and I just found it, and so, I thought this was so incredibly sweet. So this is for Rodan and Fields, and I'm all about supporting, uh, especially other women and entrepreneurs and things like that. I really love it. And I, she wrote me a little note. She sent me this this mini facial for me to try. And so I just thought this was incredibly, incredibly thoughtful. And I just really wanted to give her a shout out. I'll leave her info in the description box below if you had been wanting to try Rodan and Fields. So I just wanted to definitely say thank you so much, Lindsay. You're amazing. I love this. I appreciate this. I thought that was incredibly sweet that is it for this video guys I really hope you enjoyed watching if you haven't yet and want to hit the subscribe button you can also hit the bell that will notify you when I do post um, and if you like the video give it a thumbs up thank you so much and have a great day guys Survivor.